Hey, what's going on? Today I'm going to show you how to protect your valuables from from thieves. It's quite simple and uh, some pretty cool and useful redstone tactics. So let's get started. I'm going to start by making the trap door that the uh, unsuspecting thief is going to fall into. All right, uh, I'm going to drop down a few pistons and clear up some space behind them and drop down some reds. Well, I also need to get a redstone repeater. Uh, let's see. Here we go. Um, okay, we'll do fine. Now we need to make sure to power all of these at the same time and we can do that with the redstone repeaters and uh, link the wire together and if we drop power to the one wire, all three pistons will expand. So that's pretty cool and useful. All right, let's get rid of that uh, sand. Don't need that. All right, let's expand these, and we need to make uh, we need to mirror the same thing over here. So we want to do it one block of free. So that way, um, uh, whenever it expands, it'll meet in the middle. Wait, actually, I think two blocks. We have to understand. There's um, let's see, one more. Let's say, <laughs> because uh, whenever it opens, they're gonna meet in the middle, like. Right. Okay. All right. Let's do the same thing over here and link them together. And oh, oops. <laughs> okay. Like that. Damn. Again, like that and like that. And now, whenever um you take away the power, this will open leaving you to your demise. But this isn't very um very practical right now. So let's go ahead and dig dig down a little bit. And okay. I was going to do lava, but um I gonna substitute that with the dispenser. We'll shoot arrows at the unsuspecting thief. <laughs> okay, maybe uh, just a few more down. Maybe three. Uh, I guess we're also going to need um, uh, a pressure plate. Let's see. If I can find one. Ha! Huh. I'll get rid of the uh, the dispenser. Oh shit! No, we actually need that oh, later. Okay, <laughs> let's put these down all over the place and just dig out some room for dispenser. Um, okay. Damn! All this gravel. All right, there we go, much better. Now, no matter where you land, um, a, a dispenser will shoot an arrow at you. But first of all, I noticed a small problem. It's getting dark, but not to worry. I'm God. Let there be light. Okay. <laughs> all right, put in some, oh, I didn't think about that. Hmm. This is gonna take a while. I wish I had, um. SPC. All right, I guess I can get rid of. It. All right, well, just imagine the whole thing is full of arrow. Whenever you land, uh, you'll get shot, and you will lose some health. Probably not die, but if you move around, maybe you'll lose a few, a few stars, a few hearts. Dare I say? All right. Well, there we go. 
you could put lava down here if you're a multiplayer or something and you know give yourself some lava or if you're uh, daring you'll get a bucket and get some lava in there yourself <laughs> all right now then whenever uh, they both have power like I was saying they'll be expanded but we need a button to push that temporarily cuts off oh shit enderman and skeleton oh well Okay, I need a button. Let's find one right here. And okay. Now then, we want to uh, you know send power from this button so we can put redstone right behind it and right down there. And if we push the button, you'll notice that it gets power for a short time, just short enough to open up this trap door. So we want to go ahead and link it over here, but we need it to always be on. So we need to use a simple inverter to uh, invert the power so that it will always be on. Because it, whenever it goes off, that's when. So now it will always be open. Unless you push the button, then it will always be closed. And then if you push the button, then it will open. So let's go over here and do the same exact thing. That's pretty scary. <laughs> All right. Now, how easy was that? Check it out. Push the button, um, and you fall to your uh, demise. But right now, it's not very um, aesthetically pleasing. So let's go ahead and uh, make it look a little bit better. Give it a nice shell, and I'm. I did that out in the desert because I think that looks pretty cool. You know, like uh, almost something out of like Indiana Jones, dare I say. Some treasure hidden um, inside of inside of this. <laughs> Whoops! All right. Let's, uh Alright, there we go. Much better. Make sure it still works. Oh. It does. Okay, but we need a few more changes now before it's complete. Hold on. Man, you're disgusting. You disgust me. Spider. It's gonna take too long. <laughs> it's all time for your games, man. Oh, I should have never attacked you. I didn't ask for this. Uh, wait, got a good idea. Uh, hold on. I wonder. Come inside, pal. Come on. No, you want to. <laughs> what now? Is it no! <laughs> Come down here. Get your ass inside. <laughs> Get your ass inside. No! <laughs> Will this still work? 
<laughs> and now I'm stuck down here as well. Oh. <laughs> but there you go, man. That spider died. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Oh, but one more thing. Free. Uh, oops. Look at that. Who could resist? Let's go inside. Free diamonds! Oh boy. And that's that. <laughs> so, certainly a simple gag. I guess you're not really hiding anything. Maybe more like a, a trap. But it's still fun, nonetheless, and the, um, the basic redstone concepts could still come in handy, maybe. So, that was pretty fun. Hopefully you can find some use out of that, maybe. If not, well, I don't know. But, have yourself a good day, and I'll see you next time. Isn't that nice? All that light looks pretty cool.